my channel my name is Jamie and this is let's talk about it so today is the first part in this in the six part series I think it's gonna be six part series of my cabbage patch collection so I got this idea from a friend of mine her name is doll rescue I'm going to leave her link down below and she asked me if I ever showed my collection and I didn't and I was like I should because I've been collecting them for a while and I love my collection so yeah, let's get into it. If you don't know what Cabbage Patch Kids are, they are my favorite doll. Uh, I didn't have many growing up, but as I grew up, I started selling dolls, which got me into collecting dolls, and my favorite is Cabbage Patch Kids. They are a doll that came out in 1983, and it was a big time craze. I think it started the whole like big hit item on Black Friday type of deal. The Cabbage Patch Kids uh, bring me joy, and I know a lot of people out there just love their Cabbage Patch Kids. Um, each one is supposed to be individually different, no two are alike. I will start my first video with the Cabbage Patch that was on the top of my list. It took me a few years to get. I finally got it this year. I was very excited. And that one is the Young Astronaut Cabbage Patch Kid. This girl is Arlene Lucette is her name. How I came to adopt her was, first of all, she was on my goal list. And my goal list is a bunch of Cabbage Patch Kids that I want to collect that I need in order. And I go hunting for them. And that's the whole fun of doll collecting, is going for your favorites. I have a couple of like stipulations, I guess, or, or things I like to stick by. They have to be like new in box first. Like I love new in box because I like to open it. I want it to be mine. Um, I don't mind getting used one if I have to but I'd rather get the new in box and I will save up my money to get the new in box this girl right here I didn't know I was gonna get a girl or a boy I just know I wanted a young astronaut it took me so long to find a young astronaut because they were like 200 300 dollars new in box they were a lot of money they come in a like a spaceship type box and I don't have it here with me I'll try to insert a picture right here And um, I just wanted it so bad, but I just like couldn't get my hands on one that was a good price. I was waiting and waiting and waiting for my right Cabbage Patch Kit. And one day I was on Facebook Marketplace and there was a brand new one in the box at a house locally that I could go pick it up and I got this baby for $60. Now, if you're in the Cabbage Patch world, you know that's a steal, like seriously. I was so excited, so I didn't know who I was getting it didn't have exactly all the um information but I'll tell you I was so pleasantly surprised when I got um her home and let me show you what she looks like she comes with a helmet and it is a her because it's Arlene Lissette and let me just take off her little helmet because she is too cute she is so cute she has a tooth I fell in love when I seen her tooth. Oh my gosh, can you deal with that? She's got the cute little fuzzy bangs over here and she's got her two little pigtails, but we're gonna put them behind here because she's gotta have her helmet on, guys. So let's get her back in her helmet because that's what makes her so special. I'll give you a good look at her outfit. Looks like this. She has a little jet pack, or whatever this is, which is nice because it helps her stand up on her own. And I always have her on my top shelf with all my Cabbage Patch dolls. That's where she rests, and she's behind her poster. She comes with a poster, which the posters are like, so much money if you try to buy them on their own. You might as well just get the doll, new in box. Mine came with the poster, that was very happy. And then she's got her little, her little um, flag that she's gonna put on the moon. And this was so cool. This was my most favorite one. I wanted one so bad. I am so very happy with who I got. I honestly would have been happy with whoever. I don't discriminate on any Cabbage Patch Kids. I want anyone. I definitely was pleasantly surprised that she had a tooth because I like teeth, glasses. Some of them have like a fun smile. You can see their tongue. There's freckles. Those are called Jesmars or Jesmers or something like that. And she comes with this little thing right here. It says 1986. 
Young Astronauts Council. Oh my god, so cute. And then when you get this, it comes with this. I have all the stuff from the box. Um, it says, official Cabbage Patch Kids Young Astronaut Program. From the Cabbage Patch to the stars, Cabbage Patch Kids continue to make headlines. On October 17, 1985, a Cabbage Patch Kids Young Astronaut was presented to President Reagan. And on October 1985, the first kid, Christopher Xavier, went into space. A special Cabbage Patch Kids Young Astronaut. And an exact replica is the one that went on the space shuttle. The kid comes with an American flag and automatically becomes an honorary member of the exclusive special Cabbage Patch Kids chapter of the Young Astronaut Program. Ho! Oh, that was a mouthful. A colorful poster of the kid, they call it the kid, that sounds mean, is included as well as an astronaut collector's card. Did I get the collector's card? And a special personality trait. And when you mail in your adoption papers, you receive an official adoption certificate for your kid. This is the adoption papers. And this one was born on September 1st. And I don't know if it's me. Um, I do have, oh gosh, probably about a dozen Cabbage Patch kids, I think. And I think that most of them are born on the same day. I'm not sure. This came in there. That's pretty cool. This little card. I don't know if that's... And it's got that on the back. Yeah, it's just so cool. You know, it's so nostalgic. You When you get the new inbox ones, you get all this old paperwork that you could have, you know, bought stuff from this company in 1984. Oh my gosh, $11 for all kinds of stuff. Sweepstakes. Cool stuff. You could have, we could have got so much stuff. I would have been all over this stuff if I had money when I was a kid. And this is her astronaut trait. She likes to collect moon rocks. I'll have to get her a moon rock. I don't get the new ones. I only like to collect the Coleco ones because those are the ones that are around when I was younger, when I wanted them so bad. So those are the ones I go after right now. If this doll is something that you want to try to add to your collection, I will try to find one on eBay or somewhere and leave the link down below to a similar Cabbage Patch Kid if you want to try to add this one to your collection. So if you like this video, please press like, subscribe, and I'll see you later.